Hey Taurus, welcome to my channel and your weekly love reading. This reading is for August 2nd to the 8th. It is a general reading, so please only take what messages resonate, leave what don't. If it does resonate with you and you want to continue this reading and dive in deeper, there is an extended that is linked in the description, so you can check that out. Anyone that's interested in personal readings, there's links and information in the description for that also. Um, I'm going to begin your reading with a card from the Moonology deck just to get a message from the universe for you regarding your love life this week and then we'll get into your tarot. So Taurus, August 2nd to the 8th, what do you need to know about your love life? What do you need to know about your love life for the week ahead? Wow, hold your vision. Fixed moon. Hold your vision. So you're on the right track here. So you've got you've got a vision of something and you're on the right track. This is kind of like uh yes, you are you're on the right path here. And I do feel in regards to this hold your vision. You're going to be seeing something. You're going to be seeing progression or you're going to be seeing um, results of, of what you have been focused upon um, in, in regards to love, relationships. You're going to be seeing, it's going to be worth it. You're going to be seeing results that is going to be, you're going to be feeling like, yeah, this is worth it. Let's keep going. Okay, recent past energy surrounding your love life. Present energy surrounding your love life. Near future energy surrounding your love life. The energy that is guiding you right now. Something that you need to know. Your energy and your person's energy. Bottom of the deck. We have, wow, the fall. We've got the fall. So a new beginning here. A new adventure, a new cycle, a big new cycle. Okay, recent past energy surrounding your love life. Wow, we've got the world. Gosh, we've got the world and we've got the fall here. Okay, so something come to an end or a cycle come to an end. Not even a relationship necessarily. It could have been a relationship, but this is a cycle, a big cycle. There was a completion here and there is this new beginning that's starting um, and I do feel there's something new that you haven't experienced before that is kind of coming in here. Present energy, we've got the Knight of Rods so things are moving quite quickly. You're making some movements here. Energy is, energy is, uh, energy is good. Energy is moving quite quick feeling passionate, feeling good, on your journey, everything's kind of feeling good for you. I feel like you're motivated, you have got your vision and you're moving forwards with what you feel aligned with, what you feel to be doing, what feels good right now, what you feel passionate about or even, it's interesting because again, a lot of you guys this week, I feel I'm feeling like, for a lot of you I'm feeling singles. And I feel like this is like a single reading. You're single. You're on your journey. And you know what you're supposed to be doing and you're doing it. Near future energy. We've got the four of one. So you could be moving straight towards a connection here. You could be moving straight towards your twin flame as well. But there's some sort of union. There's some sort of harmony here. So there's something that is literally how can you just go from like <laughs> the world to the knight of rods to the four of wands there's something coming up for you and i feel like you're not i feel like you're not so much expecting it but you're holding tight to a vision and it's a vision of a connection and a relationship the sort of connection you want the sort of relationship you want a, a type of union that you want or something that you're feeling, you energetically feel this, and you're heading straight towards it here. The energy that is guiding you is the Eight of Pentacles. So you've been working hard at something, and you're still working hard at something, and you're driven, and you're motivated, and you're putting effort in, and you're building, and you're growing. 
do you know what? For some of you as well, this could even be in regards to your house, a home. For some of you, you could even be working your way towards a new home or your dream home. And you've got this vision and it's about you and it's about where you want to be in your environment. For others of you, this is going to be about a connection, a specific connection that you want, that you hold in your sights, that you are putting the effort in and focusing and working on yourself to move towards. Something you need to know, we've got a Queen of Pentacles. Look at you, very abundant here, very solid, very grounded. This is you. I feel definitely get prepared to receive some abundance here. I always get this for you though, but get prepared to receive the vision that you have, what you're working on is growing. It is growing. Could be connected to another earth sign or there could be somebody that you connect with who is just like you. Again, this is twin flame energy. They could be just like you or they could be everything that you find attractive. Your energy for the week ahead is the Six of Pentacles. You're putting a lot of effort in. You've been clearing a lot of karma, I feel. You've been doing a lot in the physical. Um, you're putting a lot of work in, putting a lot of effort in here. I feel like there's a lot of karma things that's going on for you, but you're moving forwards and you're going quick. Your person's energy is the Emperor. Your person's very responsible. Your person... I feel like your person is taking care of certain things right now in their life. A bit like you as well. See here, you're taking care of business. You're taking care of things, doing things. The person's doing that as well. The person could be doing that in a family setting, whereas you could be doing that in more of a work or business setting. Um, but they're, I feel like they watch you or they've seen you. or Not even that they've seen you physically. Maybe they know what they want. They have dreams of what they want and you're what they want. But there's something very big coming up for you. There is. This Four of Wands is very big for you. And it is like a reward. I feel like it's a reward. And it's encouragement for you to keep going. I'm going to go and take this to the extended now to see what this is. And I want to see about this person, your person. And I want to see what's going on with them. What they've been doing. How they're going to be feeling about you. What they're going to be wanting. What they're going to be doing in regards to you. I want to see... The energy that you're in right now, how this is going to be benefiting you. I want to see about this. I want to see basically everything. So feel free to join me if this resonates. Um, the link is in the description. If not, thanks for watching, guys. Have a wonderful week and I'll see you next week.